Hello there, this is Kaneko, and I'm here to teach you how to do a transparent overlay over your chat on XSplit. Um, so let's get this started. Um, since I've never seen any tutorials on YouTube, any helpful tutorials, uh, I am making one myself. So <laughs> here you go, guys. Um, so first, what you got to do is install this, um, this add-on called Better Twitch TV. What it does is that it adds a bunch of features and it changes the overlay of your Twitch TV channel. And all you got to do is just download one of any of these add-ons that corresponds to your uh, internet browser. Since I'm using Google Chrome, I'm going to be installing this one. But since I already did, I don't have to show you that part. So now, this is how your Twitch TV channel is going to look like and the rest of the Twitch TV channels that you're going to go into and what it does is that it adds a bunch of options and it shows a lot of nifty uh, settings that you can just twitch and change as you will um, but that's not the point the point is to show you how to do transparent chat on your XSplit stream uh, so pretty much the first thing that you do is go to pop out what you want to do is pop out so this is what's gonna happen it's gonna show you a new chat window and then it's gonna show you show chat on this side since I stream I always wanna have chat on both um, both uh, both windows um, since I already had a, a window open full of people writing stuff I'm just gonna use that one so yeah here we go Oops okay so now your next step is in order to actually uh, make it transparent all you gotta do is turn the actual background black how you do that if you wanna ask you just go right here go to the settings and now it's gonna show you something new that's only uh, exclusive to the pop-out uh, option what it does is that it turns the actual background to black black chat chroma key that's what you want to use there you go but we're not done yet now you go back to your X split and all you gotta do is now is go to screen region select whatever portion you want of the chat there we go there's your chat now what you want to do is screen region and now you actually have to activate legacy mode and what that does is that it's gonna allow you to actually do what I, what you were supposed to be doing which is gonna turn the actual ba uh, black background um, transparent I don't know why that it does that but uh, that's the only way I actually got it to work so n now the final step is gonna be go to color key now you go back no, now you go down to eyedrop tool since it's already doing it because I already did it I'm gonna try to um, change it back um, let's see alright okay now we're back to the black background so okay if you see this all you gotta do is color key after you turn everything to legacy mode uh, the screen region uh, now you go to eyedrop tool and then select the black background on the actual screen region not not on on XSplit don't do it on the actual um, chat do it on XSplit and that and now that I've done that it turns the actual chat transparent so I'm gonna show you how would it look like in game So there we go. There is your chat. And it works like a charm. It works perfectly. And doesn't really hinder on, on your viewers not actually being, being able to see the game. And you can still run the game at full screen. Which is pretty awesome. As you can tell right now, I'm playing Dark Souls and it is fantastic so you know for your users to actually see the whole game and still see the chat good for archives and all that stuff so 
that's pretty much the end of my tutorial. I hope you enjoyed the video and like and subscribe if you want to. Um, this has been Kaneko, signing out.